Hi there, everyone. I'm meteorologist Ashley Baylor with a check of your latest forecast. Well, as we continue through the evening and overnight hours, initially we are going to have a few passing showers out there, all courtesy of a quick moving cold front. But as you can see, that rain moves out, the clouds go along for the ride. So tomorrow morning, we're waking up to lots of sunshine with temperatures in the low 50s. High pressure slides in for Monday. That'll give us temperatures right around 66 degrees during the afternoon with plenty of sunshine. As we go from Monday night into Tuesday, mainly clear and high pressure maintains control on Tuesday, but winds will switch a little more out of the northwest, so that will cause highs to drop into the lower 60s. Look for highs 68 degrees in Elizabeth City tomorrow, 64 down towards Hatteras across the south side, 66 in Virginia Beach, 67 in Portsmouth, 64 degrees in Franklin across the peninsula, 65 in Newport News, 66 in Yorktown, 65 degrees tomorrow in Melpha, and 65 in Gloucester with winds out of the west at 10 to 15 miles per hour. Let's look ahead to the all-important trick-or-treat forecast Wednesday night as the kids head out between 6 and 8 o'clock. Temperatures will be right around 66 to 67 degrees. So depending on their comfort level, they may want a light jacket or a sweatshirt. But it's looking like a great night for the trick-or-treaters. You can actually leave the umbrella home. Now Thursday, partly sunny, highs around 77 degrees. So a nice little warm-up there, but it's short-lived because we do have a rather sharp cold front that will come through going into Friday. So you'll notice that the overnight low going from Thursday into Friday also matches the high temperature for Friday. And that's because I do think we're in a situation where temperatures will start in the mid to upper 60s and gradually fall through the afternoon as all of that cold air starts to move in. Looking ahead to next weekend, dry for now, 63 on Saturday, 64 on Sunday.